What is going on ladies and gentlemen, my name is Ecola Espresso and welcome to today's video. Now today, we're going to be talking about Advanced Warfare and something a little different than what we're used to seeing in previous titles. What I'm talking about today is the possibility of camos on our exosuits. Now we've got very little to base this theory on, but it's a start and it's better than nothing. So, at the moment we've seen two cases in which we've seen customized exosuits. Those being an official release from Call of Duty as a part of the Advanced Arsenal for pre-ordering the game, as well as a picture that Michael Condry tweeted as a part of the last US soccer match in the World Cup. Now, I get one can be a promotional pump-up picture, but the other, the advanced arsenal, that's a solid perk. That's a legitimate difference in the appearance of a player in-game. Based off of that, I can't imagine they wouldn't have the ability or idea to put more personalization into it. Now, as for the plausibility of camos on our exosuits, we've seen camos on other things other than primaries before. Black Ops 2, we had camos on secondaries, and there were challenges for them. So, where can this go? There's a few ways that I can see it going to get camos for your exos. Those being single-player carryover additions, separate Separate challenges for them in multiplayer or micro DLC. Now to break these down a little bit more, micro DLC, we can get out of the way right off the bat because we all know how that works. Pay for the camos and it's something that is really hit or miss with people. Some people like it, some people hate it. Now as for single player carryover perks, Glenn Schofield said that after each level in single player, you'd get something like an after action report in which you can get add-ons or upgrades to your EXO. There was talk that these would be carried over into multiplayer based off of a hint in an interview about the feature. So assuming that's the case, we can't really say that any upgrades could carry over and be fair because some people just don't play campaign. Like I know a lot of people, even just here on this channel watching these videos, really don't care for single player news. They just want multiplayer. So you can't really offer upgrades to a suit. That wouldn't be that fair. So that would leave us with something like add-ons, say like a camo. Something like that can be attained by playing but not giving an unfair advantage. Or we could see the traditional route in which there are challenges for each camo on the exosuits, which wouldn't necessarily be a bad thing. It would allow people to focus on more specific specific areas of their game to add a little more personal bling to their exos. As to how the entire challenge system would work with exos, that's an entirely different story because the challenges would have to play directly and exclusively to the exos and their special attributes. Regardless, based off of what we've seen, the idea for camos on exos can't really be dispelled as impossible. It's only a matter of if it will become a reality or not. So that's been my time, ladies and gentlemen. Let me know what you guys think down in the comment section down below. Do you guys think that we will be getting camos on our exos? If you did like the video, please leave a like ring down below. Any shares your Facebook, Twitter, and my specific video. Would you like that? Always greatly appreciated. If you're new here, be sure to subscribe to the best Call of Duty Advanced Warfare content. Any news and information, you guys know exactly where to find it right here up on my channel. Thank you guys once again so much for watching. My name is Nicole Espresso. As always, if you guys are having a great day, I shall see you guys tomorrow. Take care and peace. Surprise, motherfucker. <laughs>